Guys, it's 2.06 a.m. and it's my last day ever doing the morning shift. Looking rough, we gotta get ready for work. I'm using the light of my oven. <laughs> I have to look cute since it's my last day, so let's get to it. I have a special dress that I've never worn before that I've literally been saving for my last day in TV. So I'll tan my arms a little bit went out to tan in real life yesterday so i got a few freckles on my face i'm about to ice roll <gasps> if you're not ice rolling every morning you gotta do it here is the final dress reveal this freaking door red ted baker dress with a diamond collar <gasps> i got this from ella rue in dc my favorite consignment store ever it had tags on it like i literally just took the tags off of it i think i'm gonna tuck my hair behind my ears i'm not sure Okay, I just got into the building and there's a little card from me. I wonder who this is from. I really, I don't know. Oh my gosh. Oh. This makes me want to cry. This is so sweet. I live have tears in my eyes. Okay, no. This is from Nick. He's on the weather team and he got me this little card. And it says, I'm pulling for you. He said, I hope your next journey takes you where you want to be. And I hope you'll be near Trader Joe's. And he got me a $10 gift card. It's really the little things. Like, he did not have to do that whatsoever. And he went out of his way to be kind. <laughs> that is so thoughtful. Now I got to do the forecast. <laughs> Luckily, the weather is super quiet for like the next four days. So this makes my life easier. Dang it. I missed the high by one degree yesterday. So basically just go on a bunch of different websites and use a bunch of different types of data and see what they all say. Like one says the high today is 87. We have 90, 91, 88. <laughs> We've been saying 90 at least for this whole week, but Nick has 91 is what he put last night. Our National Weather Service station here, they have 89. I'm gonna go 90 and then just watch it through the morning and see if we're trending above or below and then kind of adjust it. Don't know the drill. I'm just gonna sit here and fill out the rest of this sheet and I'll be back. Okay, time to record radio. Feeling more like summer for this Monday afternoon. We'll see clear sunny skies with highs reaching right around 90 degrees and a calm wind out of the south. From NBC 12, I'm Sophia Armada. Period. Now I have to do this like six more times. <laughs> I have to do morning, noon, evening, and night, and then two of each. All right, time to do some weather. All right, 6.13 now. Good Monday morning to you. A look at the sunrise out of our Chippenham Hospital camera. Temperature is in the mid 60s under clear skies. It's going to be a really nice morning. We're already pretty warm. And then in the afternoon, I think just kind of flat out hot by then. Low 80s. At Guys, the look at my cupcakes they got me. Horses. So sweet. Ultimate mm. Later this morning. I've been too nervous to eat anything all morning because I'm just a nervous Nelly like about big stuff. But we just did my official goodbye and it was so sweet. I'll put it in here. Comfortable in the low 80s both Saturday and Sunday, Sarah. Okay, Sophia, thanks. Today's one good thing is bittersweet because we're saying goodbye to you, Sophia, our meteorologist, Sophia Armada. We want to thank you for all your hard work. You've covered record-breaking hot days, winter storms. You've done it all, worked all the shifts too, I think. Yeah. <laughs> so we're definitely gonna miss your glowing smile, your funny jokes, and just everything you do for NBC 12. Yeah, um. Sophia has a very uncanny ability to bring some positive energy into the room. So we are certainly gonna miss her, but we're wishing her all the best. And how do you feel today, kiddo? Guys, thank you so much. <laughs> I, I wanna say thank you to yeah. you too, because you've always been so kind to me, you've always encouraged me, given me so many good words of wisdom. Mm -hmm. So. Um, I will, of course, never forget you guys. These are lifelong friendships, yeah, okay? You can't true. get rid of me. Um, but yeah, I, I moved here when I was 21. I was a baby, thanks to management for taking a chance on me. I was a little rusty, okay? But I think I'm, I'm leaving and I feel like I've grown a lot, so thank you. And we leave you with a Richmond favorite, some U Crops cupcakes. Oh my gosh, and chocolate, my favorite too. <laughs> thank you for making right. this you. home for a while, Sophia. Yeah, be sure to follow her on social media and keep up with her progress. Have a good day. Now I'm gonna eat my cupcake. Mm. Okay guys, I'm officially done. I just did my last hit on TV and I'm out of here. 
I don't know how to feel. I mean, it's very surreal. I don't, I don't think it's settled in, but... Bye, NBC12. You were pretty awesome. <laughs> I don't know if I get to take all of these cupcakes with me, but I will. Okay, so now the only thing left to do is I have to go turn in my work phone. I erased it. The iconic what time it is phone. <laughs> I guess this is it, NBC12. Peace out. Get all, get all my stuff and leave. Let's close out the computer one more time. Bye. <laughs> oh my gosh. The sun is shining. Bye, NBC12. Bye, tower. I hate that tower. <laughs> Before I left, I went in the newsroom and said bye to everyone, lots of hugs, lots of, you know, they're all happy for me, there's no hard feelings, but obviously it's like, a, it's bittersweet, okay? I can't believe I'll never come back here. <laughs> Crazy! Well, I might come back to visit, but you know, as an employee. Oh, stop. All right, opening the gate for the last time. Two years. I made it. I did two years. Oh my gosh. All right, we're out. We're out! <laughs> Look, our front yard is all these crazy big satellites. Isn't that cool? Good morning. It is Friday. Way past my last day of work. But this is where we're picking up the vlog, so... These are the boxes I have packed. My goal today is to pack my kitchen, but I really just wanna leave, you know? Like I wanna leave my apartment. The last thing I wanna do is be sitting here all day, but that's what I need to do, which is the worst part. I also have no coffee. <laughs> So I'm not doing well this morning, guys. But I am so happy that I made the decision that I made. It feels amazing not having to wake up at the butt crack of dawn every single day. It's very surreal. Quick breakfast, avocado toast with ranch seasoning. It's from Trader Joe's and it's bomb. Mmm. I also made a box because I need to pack up like my coffee machine, my spatula holder, my paper towel holder, that kind of stuff. Still haven't had coffee. Gotta do that at some point. I have all my packing paper. I'm gonna leave my toaster because I'm surely gonna want avocado toast before I move, but I have not bought Nespresso pods in like literally a year. So I feel okay packing this up. Should I put stuff in here? Wow, I'm so smart. <laughs> Finally leaving my house. It's like 2.30. I'm taking these shoe racks to donate and this package and lots of errands, lots of errands. So let's get it. I'm gonna be physically ill. <laughs> I don't know if I just haven't paid attention, but gas has gone up so much. And I know it depends on what body of water you live in, how far inland you are, how close to the coast. For me in Virginia, 465, um, I'm shocked. Like that's ridiculous. That's the highest I've ever seen it. I thought it was around 4.30 last time I checked. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. All right, I found some 4.59. I could work with that, okay? I still wanna throw up in my mouth, but I can work with that. I've been giving myself the talk all the way to Duncan saying, do not get food, Sophia, you don't need it. I'm trying to really like watch what I eat, only eat healthy stuff. Oh, it's free donut day. Are you kidding me? With any drink purchase, a free freaking donut. I can't believe this. Look at that right there. A large iced oat milk latte with just one pump of unsweetened hazelnut. Um, and can I do light ice in that, please? Uh, okay. You get a free donut for that. I know, and I was like telling myself the whole way here, I'm like, I'm not getting food. I'm gonna be good today. <laughs> Coffee secured. And then I got the double chocolate donut. Well, let's go to the post office, shall we? Okay, here's to hoping that the line isn't six miles long. I love shipping stuff because I know how fun it is to get packages in the mail and I know someone else is gonna feel that way. So, I love it. <laughs> All right, drop the stuff off at Goodwill. You just saw that in the clips. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to do the freaking back camera. <laughs> Hold on. Here we go, unpopular opinion. Walmart is really the vibe sometimes. I, I really, I kind of love this place. I just need to get a few more things for moving. Guys, I put my hair in a braid last night. Oh, it looks better now. It was crimped to the core. I took it out, I was like, I can't walk around like this. Oh, 
I'm looking for plastic silverware because I already packed almost all my silverware because I'm crazy and I just get the itch to pack everything. But I cannot find small packs. They only have a hundred. I don't need a hundred. I want this one. I want the assorted 48 count. She's nowhere to be found. I guess I'll just get forks and spoons. And some paper plates to tide me over for a little while. I only have like five more days in my house, so I don't need too much, but forks and spoons and plates probably helpful. <laughs> Guys, they don't have chameleon cold brew, which you know that's been my obsession recently. I don't know what to get. Maybe Chobani? Actually, let's do her. Guys, I have my little cash register with a, a belt and everything. I always use so much when I was little, but I wanted to be a cashier or a secretary so I could use these. <laughs> Obviously, secretaries don't use those, but I wanted to be a secretary so that I could play on a keyboard all day. <laughs> I just like the clicking sound. Okay, we're at Trader Joseph's now. I really want to get some like pre-made salads and stuff. Wow, nothing was the same. Totally forgot to film anything else I got from Trader Joe's, so let's do a haul. Impossible chicken nuggets. I've never tried them before, but I want to. Then a peanut and crispy noodle salad kit. And y'all saw me get these. Peanut udon noodle salad. So yummy. And for some protein, I got some tofu so I can add that to the bowls. And that's it. I really didn't get much. I also washed a ton more dresses. If you haven't been watching my TikToks, which... It's okay, I'll let it pass this one time. I've been selling my dresses in like a newscaster's Facebook group. I already sold like 10. I'm gonna pick out a few from there and then a few more for my closet. So let's see. I'm gonna sell this Calvin Klein, this J. Crew, which I washed it, so it's kind of wrinkly. This Carl Lagerfeld, like an off-white color, off pink. This classic Calvin Klein. This, I have no idea where it's from, peplum thing. <laughs> this blue skater dress and this red Talbot's dress. Plus three more in the washer right now. If you have hella work dresses like I do, it is not affordable to go and get all of them dry clean. Wash them in cold water on the delicate cycle and then let them air dry. Perfect. That's what I've done for two years. It has not ruined any of my dresses. Obviously, if it's like suede or something, probably don't do that. But otherwise, you're good to go. Somebody on TikTok gave me a great idea on how to wrap my pictures so they don't break. I have three pictures that were hung up right above my desk. The lady said, get boxes and just slide the picture into the box like this and then tape up the top and bottom. You see what I'm saying? Let's see if it works. Okay, I think I did it. <laughs> okay, they're all packed up. Oops, my place is a mess, but I made good progress today. I also packed up my sweatshirt wall. If you remember, there were like 20 sweatshirts stacked yay high. <laughs> Narrowed it down to two. Time to drink some pre-workout because I'm taking my ass to the gym, even though I don't wanna really go. I mean, I kinda do, but I'm still, I'm still getting back on the gym train. I'm gonna do Mango Tango today from Bloom. Anything you want from Bloom, discount link in the description. Yeah. Back from the gym, I'm about to pass away. Let's do one of these bowls for dinner. And I'm just gonna slice up some of this tofu. Okay, it's so a little peanuts. I put it into a bigger bowl. Oh, I need to add avocado too. I'm putting the tofu in there raw because I'm a crazy person who actually enjoys raw tofu. So, oops, just sprinkle it in. Then I'm gonna cut up half an avocado. Is it good? Yeah, it's perfect. <laughs> then you just squeeze it in. And the dressing is so good. It's like slightly spicy. Yum. Thanks for spending the day with me. Follow my Instagram, subscribe, of course. More moving content to come. It's gonna be a crazy next few days. Mm -hmm.